According to international reports, a batch of shots has caused serious causes, uh, sorry, serious cases of blood clots among vaccinated people, prompting the countries to halt it as the European Medicine Authority launched investigations into the jab. Now, Ingrid, my question is, this is what you're receiving in Africa. Thank you. I was going to tell you, Conchita, this is why people needed to see Kagame take this vaccine. AstraZeneca is the vaccine that's being sent to majority of African countries for obvious reasons. Yeah. It can survive the temperatures and also the cost. Yeah. And well, it's the one that's okay. creating blood clots. As a matter of fact, there are some countries that are only getting, getting AstraZeneca, yes. you know? Others are getting Pfizer, the different ones, but there are some countries that's yeah, all they're that's, getting. That's what they're getting. And but we're this, also seeing some countries completely ban it. Yeah, also, Austria has stopped it. Austria is like enough is enough. And yet African countries here, we are today. I'm sure there's no No, we're, we're getting. On. We've just. Uh, we're getting the. We've gotten the second one. Huh? Yes. My goodness. So what does this say for about us? Do we? stop and hold and just wait and also questions around the safety of these vaccines that they're giving out because there's still a debate on this covid 19 vaccine all the ones that they're being given are still in their preliminary stages of being yes. figured out right so there's a still trial and error but they said that the uh the most uh, uh the shortest was it vaccine that to be ever you know like being mm. approved took for years and that was the one for months thank you so and how mumps is not as deep yes. as COVID. So, COVID is so, so the question deep. is, were we too? Did we move too quick, too fast? Oh, do you know, we're we in such a hurry. Have, uh, like a, a technology has advanced so much that back then they could not right. be able to do this. That's a good so one. Those, as those well, are the yeah. questions that someone uh, people need to ask. So, right. is it the technology right now is too advanced? Right. We're capable of getting these things really fast mm -hmm. than before. Right. So, but the question is, how genuine is this? We're already seeing flaws in the. I mean, in the vaccines that are being given. Not to mention, even before now, this is the AstraZeneca that is being given out. At the onset of the vaccination global yeah. rollout, the first vaccine that was being given out, some people even lost feeling in their faces. There's that, There's uh, the nurse really, that fainted yes. immediately after during a press conference. There's really been quite adverse effect. So, I don't know. I, I guess know. we'll have to. It makes it, you so. second guess, you know. I know. It makes you, so like, it I don't gets wanna, you thinking. I, I don't want to hear that because I would have gone for this vaccine. The last thing I want to hear is possibility.